speed. Street racing. Style. Grit. Fast, cool, super hot cars that look badass. I think Need for Speed for me is all about the fantasy of like taking a, a very simple car that I could go out and buy and just like through sheer like force of racing and practice and good mechanical skills, building it into something that's like a supercar and I can like, you know, tear down the streets. I think it's everyone's fantasy is to like take an average car and make it something, you know, awesome. Well, Fire Monkeys has been in mobile for 14 years, and but more importantly, out of those 14 years, eight years we've been spending like honing our craft, doing racing games. One of the key things we wanted to capture was the idea of, you know, really your rules, your racing, you know, really let the player own the car and modify it visually, modify the parts in it, uh, really build it up. Working with real world car designers has been really important to keep the game feeling authentic. We didn't want it to feel like totally fantasy, like you're you're driving million dollar supercars all the time. So like working with guys that are actually out there, drift racing, building new aftermarket parts, souping up, you know, these these street cars has been really great of keeping the game on target and, and keeping it authentic to the community. So uh, New Speed is really pushing the boundaries with graphics. We've got some amazing visual effects. The cars look amazing, the models are great, and the environments are very cool. So since Fire Monkeys does all their own racing engines, it's really great because we have total control over the racing environment. The rendering techniques that we're using in this game allow us to do things that um, we've never been able to do on a, on a mobile platform before. So we're generating real-time weather effects where you can see rainfall, but then you can see it um, bouncing off the streets. Uh, we use um, the pixel shading to get hyper-realistic detail on things like badges on the cars, rivets, wheels. So in order to give the, the game a really cinematic look, we use lookup table color grading, which allows us to, to very finely tune the colors that you're seeing on screen and to bring a real level of excitement and finesse to the visuals. Um, so that was really kind of key to the racing experience was to make it always feel like a, a console quality experience with our own rendering technology and put you in real world situations with like real world cars. I'd like people to experience the journey of getting their first car and then developing that car to take it from a low level car to a super powerful car that they can beat their friends with and become the number one driver on Need for Speed. At the end of the day, Need for Speed No Limits is kind of the game we always wanted to play. So when we had the opportunity to make it, it was a really easy decision. Like, we're going to make the kind of game we want on mobile to play that racing experience in the Need for Speed world.